I'm feeling if you're gone. Uh, See? Impression on point. on point. Baby, it's time to come home. Hey everybody, it's Mara from Matter Hackers and this is your Matter Hackers Minute. Sean Chung was first introduced to the possibilities of 3D printing in middle school. Now at the wise age of 14, this high school student at the Nueva School in San Mateo is on a mission to fabricate and assemble a life-size 3D printed robot Project Bot 44. Sean won first place in his high school science fair by using Fusion 360 to model perfectly symmetrical fins for his rocket. In addition to saving his team a ton of time and labor cutting and sanding wooden fins, he was able to include spin tabs to provide spin stabilization, which helped their winning rocket to fly straight up, even in the windy conditions of the Bay Area. Project Bot 44 started with the idea of building a connect controlled full body robot that would mimic the motion of its human operator. It's built with off the shelf components and open source technologies like Raspberry Pi, and it's fully 3D printable. Sean currently has three 3D printers at home, including a FlashForge Creator Pro, a Robo R2, and a CR10. He prefers starting a print before bed and then waking up to a new 3D printed piece. Getting a quick turnaround on his parts allows him to revise mistakes, make modifications, and then get consistent results when replicating the finalized pieces. The first part of the project to be completed is this robotic arm. It's powered by six servos, controlled using Arduino Mega 2560, and human operated with a Logitech Extreme 3D Pro joystick. He modeled the arm using Fusion 360 and then printed it in MH build, PLA, and ABS filament. Sean learned a lot during this process. Sanding the print and adding lubricant helped mitigate initial friction issues with the joints. When faced with tolerance issues causing imprecise movements, Sean learned that instead of using a guess and test approach, designing in advance and ensuring that the geometry and dimensions were correct from the beginning significantly reduced the number of revision prints. Overall, Sean learned that failure is part of getting to a final solution. Countless hours of repeated research and iteration and design and testing is the hard way, but the right way to get an effective design. For more information about Sean's Project Bot 44, check out the links below. What have you learned in your adventures in 3D printing? Leave me a comment, I'd love to hear about it. I'm Mara and this has been your Matter Hackers Minute. Go be awesome. Thank you for watching. If you liked that, subscribe to our channel to keep up to date with all of our videos. And remember, go to matterhackers.com to shop for everything 3D printing.